Namaste, it's me Amy of Kaido Makeup and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to create a makeup tutorial. And this is what I'm wearing right here for Christmas slash New Year's Eve. Whichever holidays you want to wear this makeup look, you can even wear it the whole year around in my opinion. You cannot get wrong with that gray smoky eye, right? So I've reached 2,300 plus subscribers. So thank you, thank you so much to my new subscribers and to my other subscribers thank you so much for sticking around so for this video we are going to actually make a makeup tutorial and uh, such a demonstration on this Carity professional 21 highly pigmented eyeshadows all the eyeshadows in here are all matte as you all can see and this is how it looks like and yes yeah, so i'm going to explain a lot of things about this product throughout the a little bit of knowledge on how this makeup actually performs and what are my thoughts upon this uh, palette if you wanted to know how i created this makeup look please keep on watching hey hello everyone so before we get started in our eye makeup look i just wanted to tell you guys that i already did my face routine and that includes my priming uh foundation concealing as well as contouring, blush, and highlights. And actually did my eyebrows off the camera just to save some time. And so we're going to focus today on our eye makeup using the Carity um, Professional Makeup. And this is how the box looks like. Um, the box and the actual palette are definitely identical. So I'm on their website right now and this um, product actually retails for $29 and it contains 21 matte eyeshadows and these are how the eyeshadows looks like as you can see it contains some cool tone eyeshadow and lots of bright and actually this was definitely i very i still i think that um i get it for 11 euro um it was 14.50 and the original price of this product is actually 29 dollars so how i actually came up with that or how i actually uh, bought this one for that price is actually because of um, Erin Klein, I think that she's the owner, I don't know, or the manager. So she's definitely at the charity team and she reached out to me a couple of times to give their products a try. But I actually hesitated so many times to um, grab this product because first of all, it's $29. And she actually gave me like 30% off the first one. But then, so obviously I still need to pay the shipping cost and that was approximately uh, $14. 12 to 14 dollars and the 30 percent off is actually not gonna help us. so i just literally just um ignored the message and then she reached out to me the second time the same things and then the third time she offered me like it was discounted this palette and plus she gave me a free shipping so i was like yes so in the end i just paid 14 dollars and 50 for this palette which i am so freaking happy about because I tried to save money as much as I could in terms of makeup or not buy any makeup at all since I'm employed. So now that you actually know the story behind this palette then that let's move on to the makeup tutorial because that's what you actually came here for right for the makeup tutorial and the pigmentation and everything so I'm going to tell you guys at the end of the video what are my actual thoughts of this one otherwise it's the makeup tutorial is not gonna happen at all if I'm gonna keep on talking about this palette and everything so let's do that so as I said it contains all of these beautiful colors right here another thing this um, palette doesn't come with a mirror as you all can see and I appreciate this palette that comes with a name underneath the eyeshadows because even if I'm not gonna show you one by one the colors if I'm gonna tell you which name then you'll know exactly which color I'm using to this eye makeup so that comes really handy so the first color that we're gonna use is called Luxuria and this is definitely um, a kind of beige color that's good to set the eye. So I'm going to color or set my primer using this color. So the next color we're gonna use is called Coquette and this is gonna be our transition color. So let's deepen up the crease using the shade Unsafe. It's a matte brown eyeshadow. These are all matte by the way. So 
So the next color that we're going to use is called Sinful, which is a matte gray eyeshadow. And we're going to apply it all over the lid area. We're not going to do the cut crease today. I'm not going to do that. We're just going to do like a smoky eye. Alright, so let's mix the two shades called Phantom and Disturbia. Phantom is a navy blue matte eyeshadow and Disturbia is kind of an off matte black eyeshadow. So I'm going to put it on the um, upper lash line and we're going to smoke it out. Um, I used this eyeshadow several times already and I definitely like the quality of the eyeshadows. They are very pigmented and they're all matte. So that comes in handy if you are like a matte lover. I love matte eyeshadow, so this is like a great palette for me. Using only Phantom eyeshadow, we're going to smoke out that uh, mix of uh, the two colors that we mix together. So just brush it on those two and bring it to the lid. You don't need to be very gentle or clean up with this um, process. Because we're going to apply the gray eyeshadow again and then smoke it out. Just go literally like back and forth with the colors that you've used already. Alright, so let's tight line first before we actually move on to the lower lash line. Alright, so for the lower lash line, we're going to mix the shade Coquette and Unsafe and we're going to dust it on our lower lash line. Alright, so now let's mix the shade Phantom and Sinful. Alright everyone, so you can uh, definitely stop from here and call it a day or you can also create a wing liner which exactly I'm going to do. So let's do that if you want to do it or just apply some forces if you don't want to do a wing liner. But I'm gonna do it. So to create my wing liner, I'm going to use my oldie but goodie NYC liquid eyeliner. So this one is not available anymore in any stores here in Holland. I think that neither in the US or any countries. They don't just sell it anymore. So anyhow, let's do the wing liner. Alright, so it's time to apply some false lashes. The whole eye makeup is done. And for my false lashes, I'm going to apply the Dodo Lashes D115. This is my all-time favorite lashes and as well as my all-time favorite brand. Uh, the whole 2017, ever since that I've tried these lashes, I'm like, yes! This is perfect. This lashes is definitely good length and a lot of volume and that's exactly what I love for my lashes. Alright, so the eye makeup is done. So I added some glitters and the one that I'm using is from Lit Cosmetics. And this one is in the shade Sheer, solid size number 3. And I really like the sparkles. Um, this is definitely optional. You don't need to do this part if you don't want to. So for the lips, I decided to use the Jeffree Star Holiday Collection Velour Liquid Lipstick in the shade Christmas Cookie. I really like this shade. I use it since the day that I got it or the next day that I got it and I kept using it. So for this look, I'm going to use this one. I think this is such a very gorgeous nudish pink color. thoughts about this product so I've used it a couple of times and you're going to perhaps see like a couple of pictures at the end of this video Yeah, 
of all the makeup looks that I actually created using this palette. I even created a colorful makeup look using this palette. So I would say though, um, because I kind of forget to mention it, but the purple shade called Ego. Please be careful with this one because this one stained my eyes. So after I remove all my makeup, I have like a pink spot on my lids it doesn't itch or anything but it definitely stains so be aware of that but other than that i truly love this eyeshadow palette because it has a tons of gorgeous shade from colorful to neutral to even those very deep dark eyeshadows that you could definitely use to create a smoky eye like uh, this so this product is obviously kind of makeup approved so i hope that you could try it of this product so I do hope that you can definitely give this product a try because it's definitely worth every penny. It's definitely pigmented. It's very opaque, all the colors that's in here. And I have no complaints whatsoever. I truly adore all of the eyeshadows in here. And you can even bring this with you when you travel because there's definitely a good bunch of colors that you can choose from. So I guess it's pretty about it. So before I end up this video, I just wanted to say that please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Give this video a thumbs up if you like. So I hope that you all enjoyed this makeup look and I hope that you can wrap this makeup look on this holiday season. On Christmas or even New Year's Eve because I think that this makeup look is very stunning. So the glitter definitely give that kind of pop of baba boom on this makeup look. So I hope that you can try this makeup look. It's very easy to achieve as you all can see so i guess that's pretty about it i don't know if i'm still going to have like a any makeup tutorial before the end of 2017 but if i don't i wish you all a lovely holiday so have fun celebrating new year and stay safe definitely so thank you thank you so much for the whole year of you guys um supporting my channel for my new subscribers thank you thank you so much for subscribing here on my channel and i hope to see you all next year on the year 2018 i wish you all the best and that's it um i'm going to close this video and happy holidays everyone and please do leave a comment down below what you think about this makeup look and what are you going to wear and what makeup look are you going to wear on new year's eve or even christmas that's it you guys so merry christmas everyone and that's all i will see you all next year bye everyone